start. Okay, Walking is a challenge for this little guy, a two-year-old, frightened, starved, miniature horse. The animal arrives at Alaquah Animal Refuge after he was seized by the Walton County Sheriff's Office. A sheriff's spokesman says the owner of the horse is now the target of a criminal investigation of abuse and neglect. We can get her to nibble a little she bit. A badly malnourished horse most likely would have been euthanized if he had not come to Alaquah. He's uh, pretty, pretty emaciated. Um, looks like that uh, he's been a while since he's had a good meal. Fortunately, the horse started drinking and eating right away. A really good sign. Now, the first couple of three weeks, especially on these cases, are. are are very important. Uh, we have to do everything very slowly to where they, they just start them back gradually on, on grazing and uh, a few minutes a day and uh, every two or three hours let them uh, have access to feed and, and so you know we have to we don't want to shock them with, uh, with uh, hitting them with, with too much good stuff all at one time. This is what a healthy miniature horse looks like. They weigh 300 pounds or more. This little guy weighs less than half that. Alaquah Animal Refuge founder Lori Hood was so worried about the animal's health that she spent four nights in the barn with a horse, waking up every few hours to provide the proper amount of food. This is what Lori Hood's Alaquah Animal Refuge does. Lori and her staff are dedicated animal caregivers. They provide the love and caring that so many companion animals seek, but are denied by cruel, ignorant, and irresponsible owners. Aliquot nurses abused and neglected animals back to health, then they are put up for adoption. Aliquot can always use your help. Volunteer, donate, or adopt a friend for life. For more information, call Aliquot Animal Refuge at 850-880-6399 or check out the website at www.aarflorida.com. For Aliquot TV, Carl Ward reporting.